Hi, in this tutorial I am going to create a Spring Boot application in which I am going to integrate simple notification service that is SNS of AWS with the Spring Boot application and in this SNS we will create a topic. Topic is nothing but a kind of channel in which the subscribers will be added and whatever you will publish to this topic the subscriber will receive this as a message. So this is the name of the topic, play Java topic and the display name is nothing but the user which will be seen by the user that this is coming from that point is known as the name display name of the topic. So I have created a topic that is play Java topic and in this I am going to provide the subscribers. All those subscribers will be receiving the message which will be passed to this topic. So let the protocol be email through email I am going to add the subscribers let this be the email of sumithappyface at gmail.com and what I will do, I will publish this message. Uh, let me reload this page and again go to the topic as you can find it that I have one subscriber but it is still in the pending state. So this subscriber needs to go to the email. See if, if you don't find the email in the inbox, you can find it in the spam because I have sent it many, many times. So this is coming in the spam. So I'll click on the confirm subscription. This shows that subscriber is has given the consent of subscription. And whatever this I will publish here in this topic. See this is the subscription and it is coming as confirmed now. After after clicking as a confirmed. And this topic I am going to send message. So I will click on publish message which is displayed on the top and in this message I will provide the subject as play java top tutorials and here I will put the body of the message that is hi this is regarding POC for SNS and I will simply provide on play java regards thanks and submit so this is a kind of email body which will be sent to the user who has subscribed to this topic and i'll click on publish message so after clicking on publish message and i'll go to the email i'll go to the inbox and i can find that see the display name is play java poc and play java tutorial is the subject and hi this is regarding POC for SNS on play Java is the message body which we have provided for that email. So this is how this topic works. So we have seen about the topic and all the subscribers how to subscribe the subscribers through email to that particular topic. You can go with the other other ways also and we have sent a message to the topic and message was sent to all those subscribers who were subscribed to that topic. Now I'm going to create a Spring Boot application and here I'll show you how you can create subscribers to that particular topic and how you can send message through the Spring Boot application. So I'll name this application as SNS-demo and I'll provide the description as demo project for SNS. I'll provide the artifact ID as com.playjava and let the package be com dot submit dot play java and click on next i'm going to add the dependency of web because we will be sending post mapping and i'm simply gonna add this dependency of amazon aws sdk so in the pom file i'm going to provide this dependency and the dependencies are being loaded and our project is being getting ready for the development. So this is the main file of Spring Boot application. Now I'm going to create a configuration file. So I'll simply name as SNS config. In this config, I'm going to create the beans, which is required for AWS integration. So this is a kind of configuration and I'm going to create a bean with marked as primary along with at the end bean annotation and I'll simply return public 
Amazon SNS client. Get Amazon SNS client will be the method name. This, this is nothing but the client which will be interacting with our code. So I'll build with the parameters like Amazon SNS client builder. And in this builder, I'm going to simply provide the standard of build with region. And for the region, I'll go to the AWS console. And here in this region, you can find it that this is US East hyphen zero two. US East OU is US East hyphen zero two. So I'll just provide the regions US East. And this is the reason after this reason, I'm going to build with client credentials and I'll here I'm going to pass new AWS static credential provider. And in this I'm going to provide new. Let me just do some extent formatting. This, this is the client key which I have provided and this is the secret key. This you can find by going into the your credentials of AWS. And this I have provided as access key and secret access key and I am simply going to call this build. So this AWS SNS client has been created. And now I am going to create a controller. So this will be the package of controller and name is SNS controller and I'll click on finish here I'm going to annotate with rest controller and provide the request mapping over the class level and let the class level annotation be like AWS hyphen SNS and I'm going to auto wire the same bean which I've just created to interact with SNS of AWS that is private and the, I'll go to the bean Amazon SNS client is the bean name and simply gonna do the import and create post mapping of subscribe through this method I am going to provide the user emails and whatever the emails which will be provided in this subscribe will be added as a subscription to that particular topic so in this, I'm simply going to pass the email and now I'm going to return. Let, let's return success first and then I'll write the method body. So all the compilation error are gone. Now I'll simply call this AWS client dot subscribe. And in this subscribe, let me remove this part. I'm going to create a new object of subscribe request. That is the second one. In this, I'm going to provide topic ARN protocol and endpoint. So topic ARN is basically the ARN provided to that topic. For that, we need to go to the AWS console again and see the topic ARN. So let me go to the SNS part and see the topic which we have created. So this is the topic which it is showing and when I'll open this topic, this ARN is coming. So I'm simply going to copy this and paste it in the subscribe request. For that, I'm going to create a final object, spring string object that is topic ARN and I'm going to paste it here. So in the email part is nothing but a type of protocol since I'm going to send an email through SMTP. So I'll just need to provide email here. And the email is nothing but which will be coming from the end user. So this I have created. Let me delete this already existing email. And now I'm going to call the method for subscription. Before that, let me clean the emails which I've already received. Go to the spam and delete this email and now I'm going to the postman to hit this AWS SNS let me start this Spring Boot application 
and this has started and now I'm going to see this has started on port number 8080 and I'll simply go to the postman and call this AWS SNS subscribe method and in this method body that is in request body I'm simply gonna pass the string that is the email no JSON nothing it's a just simply it's a text so submit happy face at gmail.com provided and clicked on send and see success is coming and when I'll go to the AWS console see in this e gmail one mail is coming for the subscription and when I'll reload this go to the bottom and see this email is there and is still in the pending state so I'll click on confirm subscription and uh, automatically its state will change to confirmed see this confirmed now so in this way we have created our subscribe API and now I'm going to create an API where I'll be pushing the message and it will be passed to all the subscribers to a particular topic so let me change the post mapping and the method name let it be publish message and let the URL be notify and here also let me change it to notify and now I'm going to provide this message here this is just to inform you that your data limit is about to exceed the permissible limit <coughs> and let me provide it as in form of mail, mail type that is regards submit and hi user so all the method body I created to that endpoint now I'm going to change this subscribe method to publish method so I'll simply write AWS client dot publish and in this I am going to create an object of publish request here you can provide three parameters or two parameters also first one is the topic here and that is a topic detail and second is the message which you are providing and last one is optional that is the subject so here I am providing data exceed the main so data exceed reminder I provider provided and now I am going to clear this console and I'll run the application again to reload everything and let me clear the console now I am going to click on send nothing is there and inbox is also let me delete the already existing data and nothing is there so now I am click on send and it will give success let me see this I have sent and success is coming and let me reload this see data exceeded reminder this is just to inform you that data limit is about to exceed the premise limit which we have sent as a message so in this way we have created a topic we have created a subscriber through Spring Boot application and also through the API we are sending the message to all the subscriber to a particular topic this is about the SNS simple notification service of AWS thank you